the official opposition, Mr. Frank Cleese, Newmarket Aurora MPP. Mr. Cleese. Thank you, Tony, and uh, welcome to Queen's Park. Uh, I'm pleased to bring greetings on behalf of Tim Hudak and uh, my colleagues in the PC caucus. Uh, I'm joined uh, today by my colleague uh, Jerry Olette, uh, Jerry, uh, from Oshawa. And uh, there would be more of us out here from all parties, but you know, it's a business day in there and uh, everybody has so many uh, other meetings. Uh, my colleague John Yakubuski uh, would have uh, been here as well, but he got called to uh, a House Leaders meeting and that's why he's not here and he asked me to express uh, his regrets. Uh, it was um, at the European Uni Union Summit in Milan uh, in 1985 that those leaders decided to declare May the 9th as Europe Day. And uh, we're celebrating uh, that anniversary here today collectively. I, uh, I was born in Europe. And uh, I still recall the number of times when I would ask my father and my mother, uh, why did you leave uh, to come here? Uh, because it was a challenge. My father was some 41 years old, uh, did not know the language, uh, had to start all over again. And that's a challenging thing. It's one thing for a young five-year-old like myself to be brought here and to come up through the education system and to learn the ways of Canada. It's yet another uh, for someone at that stage of life to break ties and to come here. And uh, the reason that my father gave me was that he wanted to ensure that there was opportunity here for his family. I remember that very well, and that's why we are here collectively today in this great province of Ontario, in this great country of Canada. But we rejoice today because the leaders of Europe decided that it was important for them to come together as well and to start anew and to make a commitment collectively that the values of freedom and democracy and enterprise would in fact live in Europe and thrive, and it has. And so we thank the many leaders throughout the European Union for having had that vision, having had that courage to come together, and there are people represented here today that continue to build those bonds between Canada and Ontario and the Union to ensure that we as world citizens can enjoy those qualities and those freedoms together. And so as we raise this flag, I just want to say one other thing about how proud I am to be an Ontarian and a member of this legislature. It's not everywhere in the world today that flags from other jurisdictions can be put up on the flagpole of the legislature of our jurisdiction. This province has exercised that on numerous occasions and it is an underscoring of the freedom and the respect that we have for others around the world. And as we raise this flag today, we celebrate all that the European Union stands for, and we thank you for being here with us today. Thank you.